what is happening everyone welcome back to another video in my channel so in today's video we'll talk about utm parameters for facebook ads what exactly are they how they work how you can actually track the data of them and most importantly how to set them up properly on your ads manager so without further ado let's dive straight into it all right so first let's go ahead and make sure we have a full understanding of the utm parameters on facebook ads we'll start off with what are exactly utms so essentially utms are custom values that are being added at the end of your link so for example this link without utms just your website.com and this link over here with utms which is your website.com with the custom values now don't worry i know it looks ugly but people will actually see your link as it is like the first option and facebook will know how to add these custom values at the end of your link now let's say we did set up our utm parameters which i will show you just in a second how to go ahead and do it how we can actually go ahead and track this data now you probably use one of these platforms platforms over here so if you use shopify or wordpress you can see this information in the analytics tab or you can install different apps that will help you to see this data better or if let's say you use go high level like myself there are multiple ways that you can go ahead and actually find this data and lastly we have google analytics which is the default option for almost everyone watching this video whether you have a shopify store or use go high level you can still go ahead and use google analytics now let's go ahead and jump into my ads manager and i will show you how to go ahead and set up your utm parameters all right so the first thing that we need to do is to go to our facebook ads manager if you don't know how to get to this page simply google facebook ads manager now let's go ahead and create a new campaign like we normally would do so we'll hit create and then let's select sales hit continue we'll select manual setup hit continue and now what we want to do is we want to go to the ad level over here so we'll click on that and you want to scroll down till the bottom where it's going to say tracking so this is actually where you're going to set up and build your utm parameters so we have to do is to click on build a url parameter and now we have this box open up over here and we have four main parameters that we can go ahead and set up which the first one will be campaign source which is let's say either facebook or instagram then the campaign medium will be our ad set campaign name will be our campaign and campaign content will be our ad so to set it up we'll simply click here and select site source name for the campaign medium we'll click again and select ad set name for the campaign name will be campaign name and campaign content will be our ad name and then let's hit apply all right perfect and now every single time that someone will click on our website url facebook will add these utm parameters at the end of our link so we'll be able to track this data all right folks this is pretty much it for the video if you did find some value in it make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already check out some other videos just right here thank you so much for watching guys and until the next one peace